What's going on? Okay. So, you guys are along for the road. Ride. Whatever the expression is. I'm recording this for you guys. I'm trying out some new stuff. Uh, Jake's girl took a couple photos of some of my new camera setups. And, uh, Nate, I hope you like it. Especially the way I'm charging my GoPro because those things suck at battery life. I will say that officially. I have used it enough to know that it definitely sucks at battery life. But, let's go over some stuff that I've been doing. I hope you guys like all this. We've been busy. We've got one Prusa uh, that's really helped out our production. It just does the finer stuff better. Uh, it just does stuff in general better. Uh, we've been pretty busy with it. Uh, in fact, I ordered another one. <laughs> She's mad at me. Yeah, so uh, enders are nice. And I yes, I've seen comments. I will do an ender review uh, on y'all for y'all, but... <laughs> What? <laughs> Nick, I put the back out princess on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's over here. Come on, everyone say hi. Look at that one. All right. I'm here. Yeah, I know, I know. She's checking to make sure I don't... I stay on target. Stay on target. Stay on target. Okay. So I've been doing a lot. I think you all have seen this butte. She's a butte. Hey. So this is... Oh my gosh, we didn't bring the sticker out. Where's the sticker? I made a sticker for this on the cricket, right? So this is just a regular ammo can. I mean, it's not regular, right? Because it's got Electron Smith 3D printed stash bins in this. And no, there is nothing illegal inside these. Actually, what's inside of them is a word I can't pronunciate. Neodymium. Neodymium, right? So I put some of these magnets inside these. And then there's other ones inside the case. And when you, boom, look at that. Isn't that sexy? I am an attractive guy. So. What's inside? What's in the box? What's in the box? All right, so what's in the box is my Fizz Tool track saw. Here, let's see. Okay, can you see? Can you see? Can you see? All right. What also is in here is any of these little accessories are just stuck on the inside using any of the metal that comes with it and more magnets, and they just stick to the magnets. And then I got these doohickeys, right? So I basically, y'all saw the little video where I just melted a nut to the inside of this for the blade. I got one of my ticks, <laughs> the clamps. You can see here, there's a little hole. And on the other side of that is a hard drive magnet. It's probably a, a neodymium. And that just locks in. And then I've got some alignment pins to keep those in place. And then again, for the other one, Jake's girl found this paint color. I think it works out pretty well. Green apple. Green apple. Who? What is it? Krylon or Rust-Oleum? It's Rust-Oleum. Rust-Oleum. So, I'd say this is good enough. I don't know what I'm gonna put in a stash bat. Stash. Stash. I don't know. Stash. You're gonna put your stash, stash can. Stash. I don't have a stash. I could put go. You have a stash. My must. I could put beard care. There you I go. I could. What do you think? Beard care. All right. So that. Oh wait. Hold on. I didn't do anything for the cord. I, I know. I'm, I'm supposed to be cordless, but I'm not getting rid of this thing because it's too much. So there you go. So I'll pack out minus the sticker. I did print a sticker on the Cricut for it. So track saw fits in there great. I know. But a that box wine dispenser. What? <laughs> it looks like a box wine dispenser. A box box wine. Hell yeah. Dispenser. I can make that. All right. So I know that this isn't all about me, and I need to be talking about you guys. So I have been working on stuff for y'all. So let's, let's go over. So big thing, right? So since we got the Prusa, uh, in fact, you can see. Where, where are we? All right, so Electron Smith, he, he doesn't get on these live feeds, but he knows I love them. So these are PETG, the new version two jigsaw holders. These things are great. Uh, as you can see by this massive bag, we have some of these in stock. So if you order these, they'll ship right away, but only these. <laughs> so here you go. PETG, pretty, right? And you got the little lock mechanism. So you put this in the uh, what we call the version two rectangles and square bit bins, and that will lock a blade in place. It's got a little Klingon on it. <laughs> you gotta wipe it a little bit more. But yeah, so these are printed on the Prusa i3, uh, Prusa Mark MK. III, MK3S. Uh, I love that thing. I mean, look at the back of that. Would a 12 inch spackle pan fit in the pack? A 12 inch spackle. Huh? A spackle. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Spackle. Ooh, in that pack out? 
I don't know. Uh, grab a tape measure while you're over there. So, yes. So we printed a ton of these, and these are available. Uh, they, we're hoping to, to be available tomorrow. And as a side note, in general, a lot of the stuff I'm going to show you, uh, that's sort of some of this complex stuff, has been printed yeah, in, in PETG, PETG. I call it PETG. Uh, I call pirated software, whereas, whereas. So, let's see. We're about 16 inches on the outside. This is going to be another pack out uh, video. Inside is, fi is 14 inches by 9 inches by about 10 and 3 quarter tall. So I think you probably could fit it in there if it's 12 inches. All right, so back to this. So what I was saying was is we've been printing a lot in Petchy since we've gotten the new Prusa. Uh, couple comments, right? So with all of the coronavirus stuff, uh, a combination of things come from that, right? So one, uh, a lot of people have been wanting masks printed and we've been trying to keep up with your orders and we can barely get enough filament to keep up with our orders and we definitely can't get replacement parts for our printers right now. So anytime a printer breaks, mm -hmm. it just sits until we can get parts. Uh, we're waiting on Amazon. We go to Micro Center as often as we can possibly go to Micro Center. And uh, we've been keeping a good 90% of them running. So right now, uh, what? Right now, pretty much all we have available is well, not all we have available. We're still keeping up with our orders pretty well. We're, we, say people, we say to people four to six weeks, and we've been pretty much keeping up with that. We have done a couple special things, uh, which I'll show you, that take a little bit longer time. Uh, but with the new Prusa, we're able to pump out stuff like this reliably. It's good quality. That's what I was going to get at, right? So I'm long-winded. Two downsides. One is the material costs a little bit more, and uh, it just takes a little bit more time to print because... We print them slow to make sure they come out right. So they're going to go up a little bit in price. Uh, that'll be on the site. It's not going to be insane. Uh, typically, when we sell like a bit holder, it's two bucks. I think it's going to be like two fifty or three bucks or something like that. But you check out the website. You'll see that. That aside, it lets <laughs> us print new stuff, which is these mechanisms that move. Right, this thing slides in and out. We like it. We like it. We like it. Slides in and out. Okay. So these are going to be available hopefully tomorrow. That's the version two jigsaw holders. A lot of people have asked me for it. Uh, I think you could blame this on me, even though I technically say that Electron Smith will take credit for it, but I challenged him to make a better version of the Milwaukee one, or at least to clone it, and he did it, and he did it better. So this is a 3 8 inch socket holder for the bit pins that he's designed that we print and, and sell, store.jigaball.com. Link somewhere somewhere okay so holders PETG as well they just work better in Petchy that's a 3 8 and that's a quarter inch and you can see it's just got a quarter inch there to be able to connect into your socket and this one has got 3 8 that one's mine okay what else have we been working on so I don't know if you saw but I'm blaming this one on all of you on the internet. So SDS holders, right? So this is like, this is my Iron Man reference. Mark one, it's pretty crappy. <laughs> There's some animals out here. So that's the Mark one. It worked pretty well. I printed out a couple different sizes to try it out. Okay. This is Mark two. So as soon as I posted it, Electron Smith said, come on, dude, you can do this better. So I was like, yeah, okay, okay, you're right. So he gave me some tips because he's an awesome guy. And this is Mark II. I didn't like the way it held, but it definitely looks better, and its tolerance is the way it engages the bit. So, Mark III slash IV. Ooh, it's, the black it's the big black pack out. I mean, it's not the big one, but what do we have here? All right. So this is Mark IV. SDS holder. It actually fits pretty darn good in both directions. So what I recommend is that side to go into the detent, and you can hear it if you're listening. Listen, shh, I won't talk. Oh, that's satisfying. And boom. So you can get six bits in here if they're not massive in the shaft, because if the shaft is too big, oh, sorry, <laughs> if the shaft is too big, then you might get five. But it rotates out like it should, 
boom. And what's this you see? This, this, is, this is craziness, but damn, isn't that sexy or what? You can get this. She's going to hate us. I will kill you. Okay, because <laughs> I have tried everything except for printing them on the Prusa uh, in the G-code to make these paws, but the enders will just fail every time. So we pretty much set a timer and stop the print at that point and change the filament. And they look super... He, he's, he, he means I I stayed it. up till 1 o'clock in the morning to do the first set. It was all mind me. Mind you. All right. <laughs> See, she's always got to steal the thunder. Right? I do. She doesn't have a beard. I'm, I'm cuter. Though. If she had this much beard, hair, I'm though. Cuter. The circus. All right. So there you go. Two colors. We can do some custom stuff, but it does cost more because this literally. I mean, you you have to sit there and babysit the printer. Uh, so if you guys want something like this, PM us. Uh, just be prepared that it's going to be at that. Money, money, money. It's going to be that six week time, not the four. Uh, what else have we worked on? Uh, so we made some squares. These are pet G. Yes, the makeup tutorials, right? So these are the little handle locks for the large pack out. Uh, these are an Electron Smith design as well. You guys know that we're the, uh, well, she's the pack out princess. These are the king pin. King pin, right? Oh, how do they look? <laughs> so sexy. So these little pins to lock the handle uh, so you can pull it out to get in the bed of your truck. We have available these little doohickeys. Let me show you them. Right, so these lock. So when you pull this pin out, it'll lock and hold it open. Okay, so these will be available. We're gonna just adjust the cart in PayPal so that you can add these to your cart with, you know, these. So you buy a pair of these, you get a pair of these. So uh, they're not gonna be expensive with these. These things take like nothing to print. We could not get them to print on our endos. They just weren't accurate enough. Uh, they just kept failing, but they you hold them on with a little piece of carpet tape uh, or you could glue them in place. Hopefully you can see that well. So those, what's those, what else do we do? What else do we do? What's that? Should we, uh, should we do, what do you think we should do? I think we should do stickers and then we can do the giveaway. Stickers, yeah. Come here, Julia Gullia, or mini Sarah. Oh, okay. okay. What am I doing with these? What, uh, doing with what these? do we got? We're going to show me stickers. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, first one. You're not going to talk. I don't know. Whose is it? What does it say? The jumbo know. slice. Mm. I don't know who Nobody the... hates a jumbo slice. Oh, uh, no. We got Neff the Tech. Neff the Tech. Wait a minute. Hey, look at this one. GoPro. Holographic. Heck yeah. Holographic. And then we got... Tetra Electric. See? See? Ooh, 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 ooh. What else do we got? Oh, wait, there's more of those. That's oh, the F lights I put on my truck. Yep. 511. Are we allowed to do this one? <laughs> why Why would we not? I don't know. Yeah. And, okay, so this one was. Did we open this one yet? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, yeah. These Architectural are. concrete, right? Yep. Sweet. What else do we got? I don't That's know. that one. This one is from, oh my gosh, if I can open it. Oh yeah. Who sent us this one? So something on the back, yeah. Brandy Rittner. Thank you, Brandy. Yeah. Appreciate it. Just don't pull me over. Yeah, exactly. I have way too many tickets already. And the insurance is, oh yeah, sorry about that. And we've got, hopefully I didn't ruin his. I know he's on, the he best was for on last, here. right? He was on here a minute ago. What? He's not on anymore? I don't, he was. Who's this one? We all know who this is. Tony. 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 He, up, Tony. He was on live not too long ago. He was sitting by his fireplace roasting his weenies. And he gave us some more. Roasting some weenies. Roasting some weenies. See? Lots of stickers. Yeah. We're going to have to put them on the, the cabinet. The cabinet. All right. So, should we get to it? Yep, we can get to it. Because that's what people want, right? Yep. Okay, so, if you guys are watching this on YouTube, I apologize, you're not going to win this. But you've won a lot of stuff. So, deal with it. You know what I mean? If you want to comment below and let me know what else I should get rid of. I was actually thinking about doing some 3D printed giveaways. Uh, we do these Misfits. So, I thought about getting some ones that weren't crunchy. 
uh, ones that just had some blemishes and basically having some people comment some stuff. So if you guys want some and you would want me to do a couple of YouTubes on that, I know we've gotten a request for a shop tour and a pack out tour because at this point I need to do an updated shop tour. So I think I'll do that in YouTube and I'll do the pack out in YouTube. Cross share it over here to you Instagram guys. So uh, let's let's do this. So the uh, the giveaway. We had a lot of likes, we had a lot of comments. Parkway Wholesaler sponsored this one. Not this video, but they sponsored the giveaway. So what it was is you had to like them. You had to like Ideal Electric. You had to like me or follow me, whatever that stuff is. Like, follow, share, subscribe. We had 387 likes and 342 comments. Uh, 340 of those were the same person uh, that just commented a lot of friends, but no, I'm kidding. We're serious. So we did get a winner. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and, and mind you, disclaimer for you that see this on Instagram, because you're going to know who won this, and that's where most of you are. He is going to try to ship it as soon as possible, but with the coronavirus, a lot of stuff is shut down. He's operating his warehouse remotely, doing orders from home, drop ship what he can. So patience, we're going to write you down. We got a picture saved of you, and you will get notified. We'll message you and we'll comment all that good stuff uh, you will get your stuff it just might take some time uh, and if you do get your stuff in some good time or bad time definitely take share. a picture and share, share and tag us in it when you get it and show us how much you love that freaking awesome pipe bender can opener bottle opener the thing is sweet i want it why do i not get one i want one okay so who is it it is can, i don't know sure. if you guys can see this it's hvac guy for you hvac guy for you because we know the way these hvac guys don't know how to put any type of ring terminal <laughs> on their wires so you guys need some extra help i'm just kidding i'm just kidding i i've never had to put a bump start on an air conditioner I've, I, I don't know how to weld pipes and stuff like that and how to lay pipe when i don't know how to weld so we appreciate everyone that participated in the giveaway it was an awesome one. A lot of turnout. A lot of new friends and family on here. What's up? Perfect temperature HV. Oh, oh, perfect temp. Sorry. KB, you want some two-tone bins? <laughs> no, no more. I mean, let's. I'll do anything for 20 bucks. 20 bucks is 20 bucks. That's what I say. That's my line. My knees are sore. Okay. So, yeah, I appreciate uh, everyone that followed along uh, for that uh, fun giveaway. I wish... Uh, we could have been announcing the winner before uh, the plague hit. I mean, it's it's like the ebonics plague, right? And yes, I said it that way because that's where we're at. It's not the bubonic plague. It's the ebonics plague. What? You don't I like? Didn't say it. She's looking at me like you crazy. You the man on the tower. They don't need the fans. Oh, well. nice. So, if you guys don't have any other questions, I know that everyone's been going live. But this is just for this is for YouTube too, and I know everyone's been getting tired of watching people sit in hot tubs. But we're gonna head out because we've got some website stuff to do tonight, so that hopefully by tomorrow, uh, I don't know what time, you guys will see some new stuff. We're gonna probably try to do some new categories on the site, make it a little easier to find stuff. Uh, you know, I don't know what else you want me to say. I mean, if there's no more questions, what is this? Kimmy <laughs> said, my wife hates me already. <laughs> Wait till she see what comes. Oh, dear. Oh, oh, he, uh, I, <laughs> right, Kimmy? He's from Australia, yeah. What did you just knock over? I don't know. Anyways. So, it, Australia. If you want to do a sticker swap. You guys are going to love. Did you just drop that? No. no. Oh, yeah, she just dropped a Gen 3. <laughs> Hopefully, no, Milwaukee's no, nothing but heavy duty. No, she didn't. Nothing but him, Milwaukee. So yeah, KB, you're the reason that we just bought, you know, two massively expensive printers because this Pet G stuff is is the cat's meow. And uh, I also want to, before I, you know, out of here, I want to thank Electron Smith. He's a man, Hightower. The shit you come up with is awesome. If you guys don't know, uh, in YouTube, there'll be a, there's always a link for Electron Smith. Whether I post a video that has anything to do with 3D printing, he's always in my links because his stuff is awesome. So check it out, Electron Smith. 3dprints.electronsmith.com is his site. Uh, he might have some other like subdomains or something like that. But if you go to 3dprints.electronsmith.com, you'll find him. He's on Thingiverse, even though that site's been sucking. 
and he's on here as Electron Smith. His name is Benjamin Johnson. What's that? Bought it on Amazon. Yeah, I, Amazon. I it's in my I go to my store store.jacoball.com if I haven't shamelessly plugged that twelve times. Uh, there's a link under like packouts and stuff like that. Maybe I'll make put, make that a separate link, like third party links or stuff like that. I've got a lot of stuff on there for Amazon and whatever else. You guys use that. It gives me a buck or two so that I can afford to pay for her to get her nails done. Of course, now I got to do them. Now I'm the, now <laughs> I'm like, hi, Miss Jacob, how are you doing? You want me to do it now? And then she's like, dude, that is like super racist. I'm like, what? It's the Corona version. It came from China. From China. So, from China. That's a great, I love that clip. I don't know about you all. I don't care about politics, but that stuff is hilarious. So we love y'all. Uh, and I guess it's time for us to, what is it time for us to? Say goodbye. Pack how, out. How do we say goodbye? Goodbye. Robert. Pack out. Oh, that was so unenthusiastic. Hold on. Ready? What about this? Pack out. It's like a fit. Pack out. Okay. All right. Peace. Pack out. Pack out. Edit, edit, edit. Edit, edit, edit. Oh, hopefully the audio works. Edit, edit, edit. Nobody wants to see my truck. It's got a list anyway. So do me a favor, go around and check that one. Make sure it's showing me fine. Make sure it shows this fine specimen. Mm -hmm. I'm going to sit here and talk to nothing until tool, tool time Tony shows up. Tool time, where are you? <laughs>